microglia responsible for weight gain. Hypothalamus plays a crucial role in eating, and believed to be the cause of eating disorders and obesity. A study from University of California, San Francisco suggests that microglia are the new targets for obesity and its treatments. Microglia, immune cells of the brain, are not neurons, and they account for 10 to 15 percent of the brain cells. Targeting microglia of the brain is a novel way to treat obesity and its health consequences. This avoids many side effects of the obesity drugs currently in clinical use. Sunil Kalewad, assistant professor of medicine at the University of California, San Francisco Diabetes Center, is the senior author of the study. Published on May 29, 2017 in the journal Cell Metabolism, the mediobasal hypothalamus of the brain contains key groups of neurons that regulate food intake and energy expenditure. Normally this region attempts to match the number of calories ingested in food with the need for energy to maintain a healthy weight. A previous research has shown that dietary fats can drastically alter this balancing act. In the present study, the researchers showed food rich in fat for four weeks cause microglia to expand in number and to trigger local inflammation within the mediobasal hypothalamus. Such a diet result in eating more food burn fewer calories, and gain more weight compared to taking a more healthy, low-fat diet. Depleting the number of multiplying microglia in the mediobasal hypothalamus, using a drug PLX5622, researchers found 20% less weight gain, compared to a control group on the same diet. To confirm this finding, the University of California, San Francisco researchers developed a strain of genetically engineered mice in which they could use a drug to activate the inflammatory response of microglia at will. They found that even in mice fed a healthy, low-fat diet, forcing microglia-induced inflammation in the hypothalamus caused mice to eat 33% more food and expend 12% less energy, leading to a fourfold increase in weight gain compared to untreated mice on the same healthy diet. The inflammatory activation of microglia is not only necessary for high-fat diets to induce obesity, but also sufficient on its own to drive the hypothalamus to alter its regulation of energy balance, leading to excess weight gain. So, eliminating microglia can prevent weight gain in humans as well. A drug, PLX3977, which is currently in clinical trials leukemias, solid tumors, and rare forms of arthritis, acts by the same biological mechanism as PLX522. The researchers also report that high-fat diets trigger microglia to actively recruit additional immune system cells from the bloodstream to infiltrate the mediobasal hypothalamus. The new recruits also augment the inflammatory response and its impact on energy balance. Therefore, it may be possible to control overeating and weight gain through multiple immunologic approaches, targeting microglia as well as targeting cells in the blood with the capacity to enter the hypothalamus and take on microglia-like functions. The researchers next plan to further investigate how, exactly, consumption of high-fat foods leads to the activation of microglia, and whether there are ways to intervene to block these signals. Human brain imaging studies in recent years have found that, compared to lean individuals, those who are obese are more likely to have expanded populations of glial cells, the group of brain cells to which microglia belong in the hypothalamus. This same sort of phenomenon, gliosis, is commonly seen in neurodegenerative diseases, brain trauma, bleeding, infection and brain cancer leading researchers to conclude that dietary excess might essentially cause a form of brain injury. Microglial responsiveness to dietary fats makes some sense from this evolutionary perspective. Rich food was rarely available during mammalian evolutionary history, and when it was available, it would be advantageous for animals to stop hunting or foraging and focus on chowing down. Microglia have evolved the ability to rapidly trigger increased appetite and weight gain in response to a high-fat diet. Fats are of calories that ancient humans might ever have the opportunity to consume. So, 
when primitive humans finally obtained a meal after a long period of fasting, microglia may have been essential in relaying the presence of this meal to those neurons that would stimulate maximal appetite. But in modern environments, in which high fat food is continually available, this same adaptation can be damaging. In the modern world, when people constantly overeat rich, high fat foods, chronic microglial activation could produce a more permanent stimulation of neural circuits that further increase high fat food intake, leading to the development of a vicious cycle. Targeting brain inflammation could help treat obesity. Thank you.